Hey, babes! Guess where we're at? We're back in our closet! <sighs> OMG. It's, it's happening. Okay, so you can clearly see it's getting lighter and brighter by the minute. So you can see every one of these is getting lit up. You can see there's going to be glass shelf, glass shelf, glass shelf. They're going to put the knobs in there. Three glass shelves, three glass shelves. Three. So they've got all the strip lighting in now, I think. I think. <laughs> <laughs> For now. So we're doing all the strip lighting. I think all of it's in. You can see they've been drilling the holes to get ready for all the glass shelves. Remember? Two glass shelves, two glass shelves, three glass shelves. 83 glass shelves, so you can see the purses are a little overcrowded on this end because some of these little purses, like this one, or this one, are supposed to come down here and be on a shelf down here. Ah. You see? So a lot of these little purses are supposed to be on these end caps, or some of these cute purses are going to be in here on a shelf, you know? Got so it. everything's kind of crammed in here right now and it's setting here, but this is by no means where everything is going to be setting in the long run. But you can clearly see they still have to light up the pods. It's a work in yeah. progress, but glass is on, the pods have to be lit up. The strip lighting has to be not only on the inside of the pods, but on the outside of the pods. Ooh. Yes, that's going to look amazing. They've got the pup lighting and the strip lighting in all of my clothes. Down here in the jewelry cabinets and the belt collections. Up here, above the bar. They're putting the fronts on all my drawers. they got to put strip lighting down by my boots. It's a process. But the film crew is going to be here June 3rd, and we have to be ready. Yes. So... All these boots have to go back in here. It's a process. It's a process. <laughs> the blinds got hung. We're so excited about that. Oh, it's turning out so pretty. We still need another mirror here. 83 glass shelves. We need glass in the doors. Guess what came in, Fab, while you were gone? Oh. Ah. O-M-G. So. Guess what? Wow. So Sergio has been putting all the poles on all of my stuff in the bathroom uh -huh. this week. So next week he will start installing all the poles on all the closet doors and drawers wow. in here. So we still have 12 more that were on back order. They should be arriving today or tomorrow to get the okay, other 12. Okay. But otherwise that whole box is full of Schwarzschild crystal handles and it's going to look Stunning! Wow. Yes. Okay, I see y'all were getting some work done while so I was gone. we were working our asses off. And look what, look what got hung. Remember the Chanel painting? Aha, uh -huh, the one you stole from that cousin. <laughs> look how perfect she is right here. So we're going to get ready to put champagne bottles in the racks. This will be filled with champagne. My seat cover is getting made as I speak. <laughs> so I'll be... Doing photo shoots right here. Oh, yes, this yes. is a good spot for photo yes. shoots. Yes, yes, yes. So, and then we have industrial rods that are going to hang here that are going to be in gold to match the gold on here. Mm. So, somewhere in the next two weeks, this closet is supposed to be finished because the film crew will be here to film it. Wow. Yes! Countdown so, begins. And I have just now ordered. The 27 wax leaf legustrums and the 30 rose bushes that are going to be out here in the uh, rose garden that we're creating off the doors of the closet with a water fountain and some benches. Mm, mm, so that's mm. going to be pretty when we open the blind. So it's happening. <laughs> yes, while you were gone having fun in LA. <laughs> yeah, we're doing some work. We were working. <laughs> we were working. So tomorrow, my two new windows arrive for the bathroom and the dining room. And then next week, they will come back and hang the blind for the dining room. So, wow. 
And then we're going to take those two windows that they took out in the dining room, uh -huh. put them up where we already have the openings ready upstairs. Uh -huh. And then the gas grill and the refrigerator and the ice maker for the outdoor kitchen arrive tomorrow. Mm -hmm. So they've got to finish the cabinetry in the outdoor kitchen, the washer and dryer for the uh, apartment above the garage uh -huh. is supposed to be getting delivered, I thought today, the 18th. I thought today mm -hmm. I have a renter that's going to be renting the upstairs apartment above the barn. Yes. She needs some help. She's going through a divorce, so I'm helping my friend. So got to get that ready. <laughs> <laughs> so, ah, yeah, so we're just busy, but it's been a while since we updated you here at the ranch, so let's go. Oh, my custom made sofa is here. And God, it's wrapped in plastic. Yes. There's two pieces. There's two pieces, right? Yes. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh my God. Yes. Two pieces, right? Yeah. There's the other half. Yes. This is gonna be so pretty, guys. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm so excited. There it is. Oh my God, it's so pretty. I love the acrylic legs underneath with the brass on them. So pretty. So this is a huge sofa, guys. I don't know if you can tell how big it is. It's two pieces. It's over. I don't know. It's, I know it's more than 10 foot long. Actually, we need to find out right now how long it is. But this is a big, huge, huge, huge living room, formal living room, where the chandelier is. And it is beautiful. Uh-uh, not on the sofa. Look at Caroline is gonna pow pow. Caroline is gonna pow pow. <laughs> Caroline is gonna pow pow. Oh. Beautiful. You already messed up the pillows and everything. But I love the couch, guys. Look look at the curved arms. Yes. Oh my God. Love, love, love. I already messed up the pillows. Carolina. <laughs> gonna get Carolina's couch all dirty. She's gonna get mad, pow, pow. Ricky's already claimed this sofa, I swear. He's, not, he's like not moving. He wants to be on this sofa constantly. He's like, yes, mom, thank you for the sofa. <laughs> So cute. And Nikki, she'll just be hiding underneath of it. Love it. Dizzy lay in the tile in the guest shower that we made bigger. So we're using the four by 16 subway tile going up and down. It's gonna look so cool. A little shampoo niche. It's gonna look so amazing. A 42 inch piece of glass. So cool. Yay! Started laying tile in the catering kitchen. They got all the old tile busted out and they are laying brand new tile. So we're making progress. And the bedroom got done. So it is done. We've put a bed temporarily in here. In case my husband has to sleep in here for a nap, we will be sheet rocking next week. So, but at least we have a quiet room over here if he has to get away from the noise but yes okay over here we've got green beans and sweet peas and peppers all growing in here and then over here we've got more green beans sweet peas cucumbers and i believe lettuce and carrots and over here, we've got more bell peppers, celery, 
basil, cilantro. And in there, we have four tomato plants and strawberry plants. Yeah. So they're even here today on Saturday, trying to get this shower finished. Oh my God, it's gonna turn out so pretty. I'm sure he's gonna get it finished here. Then all they have to do is grout it, tile the shampoo niche, do the floors, and then this bathroom will be done too. Yeah. So pretty. I love this large, large subway tile. Four inch by 16 inch. Tiling in here. I'm hoping they have the intricate stuff done over there today. I think he can't do any more in there. That's got to dry before he can go do that. But hopefully he can get those done over there and maybe right here before the day is out. So this is happening today. I'm finally getting poles put on my drawers and cupboards and everything in my bathroom today. Yay, we're making progress. We have all of the drawers installed now. We are just trying to slowly but surely get the poles uh, installed. They came in on Friday. So it's gonna look good, guys. It's gonna look good. Yay, let's get going, boys, faster. So we have the guys here getting ready to hang blinds today. And then, of course, we still have these guys in here trying to get this window ready. And, of course, we still have the tiler guys doing tile. It's looking amazing. Hopefully, they're going to be done maybe in here today or tomorrow. Blind getting hung there. One over here. Lots and lots of work happening, guys. Got tile being laid in my bedroom to touch that up. We got roofers out there doing their thing. Getting ready to put the roof on the outdoor living area today. So here we are. They're getting ready to put the new metal roofing on the outdoor living area. It's all laying back there. I don't know if you guys can see it back there where that guy is right there. It's all laying back there. These guys are putting new paper on. So we'll see if they start to put it on today or if we're just doing all this prep, 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 prep. So let's go downstairs and see what's going on. And they are beginning to lay the roof on the outdoor living area. Yay! Cannot wait. Must be about a two day project, you think? Maybe three, I don't know. Might go fast now that they're actually putting a tin on. I call it tin, it's not tin, it's metal. <laughs> Even in Lamar's closet, he's got a nice privacy shade on his window now. We've got to do all the valances so that it looks good. My shade looks amazing. So what's going to make these shades look so cool is we are going to have Mr. Sergio here. He will be building valances that go above them to hide all of the plugs and hide all that. It actually just makes everything look amazing so i love the ones out in the living room in the bar because they are the solar panels so solar meaning you can see out see how you can see outside you can see out but it blocks the sun from being able to heat up the room or anything so yay Carolina's happy. <laughs> so nice. Love, love, love. So can't wait to show you guys how these are going to look once the valances are built and painted. So everything ties together nicely. And they're out here trying to cut all this stucco off. 
so we can get this opening ready for the window. Let me get a few swings on that. And just like that, it's out. It is ready for the window to be installed tomorrow. So we're gonna put plyboard over it now to keep the heat out and the bugs out till tomorrow when the window gets put in. Yay! Literally looked everywhere in the house for Carolina. Uh-oh. Uh-huh. There's Fab and Carolina. Really? Okay. Spotted, spotted, uh-huh. I knew the minute we blew up the boat, you guys would be in the pool. Okay, okay, and you call this a work day? <laughs> I guess you are allowed a lunch break. <laughs> nice, when did you guys blow up the boat? <laughs> It's Wacky Wednesday, and we got this huge boat in the pool. It seats 10 people. That just tells you how big the pool is. That, that floaty holds at least 10 people, sometimes 12, depending on how many people are drinking and how many people pile on it. But it seats 10 people comfortably. I see they've got more blow up floaties over there that she's been blowing up, and they are in the pool enjoying themselves. Nice, nice. Now I know, now I know where I'm going to find you guys every day at lunchtime. <laughs> Mom, if you're watching, I promise I'm working. <laughs> Don't try this at home. It's for video purposing only. <laughs> oh my God. And you guys say I'm not nice to my employees. Really, people. Yes. Ricky, Ricky. Ricky. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> now, next thing you're going to ask me for a margarita. Where's the margarita machine? Where are the margaritas at? <laughs> Five o'clock somewhere, right? Uh. I knew it. I knew it was time to get into the pool. It's that time. Oh! <laughs> Did she fall out accidentally? <laughs> Accidentally or on purpose? <laughs> okay. Well, mind you, I just came back from vacation, so I'm pretty well. This is perfect. It's not all work and no play. We we work, we work hard, we play hard. I gotta find my other dog. I see Ricky over here, but I don't see Nikki. She's probably upstairs. Uh, you know that plastic stain up tomorrow up the window? Oh, we still have a gap in the fiber. I can put the plastics outside. Oh, there it is. Now you can hear. Now if somebody would start talking, but see so you can hear? Oh. Look at Fab down there trying on my purse. He's going to wave at the cameras. <laughs> oh, now he's walking it looks away. looks like now this is the fake wall that they built. They are now going to get ready to take two windows out, cut the plyboard out, and then cover it with plyboard till the window gets put in tomorrow. And once again, we're not putting rock back on these walls right here. It's going to be sheetrock around this new window. The only rock will be down there on that wall only. Yay! They are grouting the shower. It's looking so amazing. But I love the grout that I picked out for the shower too. So this is gonna look amazing. They're gonna get ready to put the floor in today. Wow. So the wood and the plastic that we've had up for ever, it <laughs> seems like, is gone. Finally. And now this is ready. So it's framed. 
All they have to do in the morning is take the ply board off outside, mm -hmm. put the window in, take the plastic off. OMG. Look how big. And my dining room chairs are getting delivered tomorrow too. Ooh. So on Friday's video, guys, you're going to get to see the window in and my new eight dining room chairs that I've been waiting patiently for. So this area is going to look a whole lot different. A whole lot different. And this wall is no longer going to have any stone on it whatsoever. It will all be this wall. Nice. That color. So it'll just, that'll be the only wall that has rock on it. So that's my accent wall. Y'all thought I was stupid when I was painting everything, but there was a grand way. Oh, yeah. You just have to wait and watch it unfold. So now it looks perfect where we just have one dark gray wall mm -hmm. for an accent. This will be like colored like the rest. This is going to look so good. So good. <laughs> so excited. So, look at there. Roof's almost done. All right. Look at that. I think they got all, I think this is the last side to get done. I think the other side's already done. Yeah, because they were working on it earlier. Yeah. So, let's let's sneak out here and see. Don't you like how they all wear green or orange? Yesterday they were all in green. Oh, okay. Today they're Color all Color coordinate. Green. Huh? Color coordinated. I know. And they stay totally covered up. I seen one guy had a full mask. Like I know. But what's funny is I asked him why, and he said because as they sweat, their shirts get wet. And it keeps them cool. Interesting. So staying in I wet. I figured it would be hot. No. He said staying in wet clothes. So they they stay covered up so uh -huh. they don't get sunburned. Mm -hmm. But it also, because their clothes are wet, because they're sweating. It's cold. They stay cool. And I was like, huh. Ah, okay, science. I just found that out. Okay. Because I'd be up there in a, crank, in a little tank top, crop top, <laughs> some little booty shorts, because it's hot. Uh-uh. <laughs> Not you'd the be way to do it. down looking all red. <laughs> and you'd be like a little tomato. Like a lobster. <laughs> you'd be like a little tomato. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. That would be me. You can't come out here because you're going to chase them. And I know what you're going to do. No. She's ready. You stay. No. Nope. She's ready. No. They got this side done. Yes. And they got the other end done. So I think tomorrow... I don't think that my water house is done, though. No. But tomorrow, all they have to do is the water house. Sweet. Yeah, it's just out there on it. Ooh, it's hot. Mm -hmm. It's like 95 degrees here. Somebody said, oh, in New York, we're still cold. Wow. Okay. <laughs> well, I don't live in New York, <laughs> but we're, we're happy to have summer. <laughs> it's just hot. It's just hot. But anyways, um, yeah, so this should all get wrapped up. Uh, by tomorrow, I've already contacted my gutter man. He's going to stop by Saturday, do some measurements, mm -hmm. figure out where he's going to put his down spots, and probably either next week or the week after, we'll have a gutter system on the outdoor living. Sergio's team is going to be working on cabinetry to get those cabinets ready because they already have the quartz for oh. the outdoor kitchen. And remember, I told you the grill and the ice maker and the fridge are uh -huh. right tomorrow. So. So, so we're in for a lot of Friday. We're going to be having a 4th of July party. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I could better order that margarita machine. Yes. <laughs> have them hot dogs and burgers well, we've ready. We've seen you chest it out the pool <laughs> today. So does it pass your inspection? Oh, yeah. That was the highlight of today. Ooh, ooh, I like. I went with pink again, but a different shape. I like the pink on you. Different technician. Very Barbie. Barbie. <laughs> How's that go with the Barbie house? Does she lives in a Barbie house? Drives a Barbie car. I'm a Barbie girl. There you go. And I'm Barbie. There you go. Sing it. Sing it, Pat. Sing it. <laughs> Anyways, you know, in, uh, did you read our last uh, on our last video? They called us uh, uh, Ethel and <laughs> Lucy and Ethel. Lucy and Ethel. <laughs> that is us to a T. We are now Lucy and Ethel. Okay, we've officially been tagged. So, anyways, guys. A lot going on here. Friday's video is going to be even more jam-packed. Oh, yes. But we're going to try to throw in some Fashion Friday there for you, too. Mm. So, some more, some more fashion. Get, get back in that closet. It's getting more and more done by the day. So, anyways, hope you enjoyed today's video. It's time to go do a photo shoot now. Bye-bye. <laughs>